I'm Dan Tellerico, and I'm here to tell you a little bit about advertising online. Um, this is a video series we've been doing to help people understand the fundamentals of online advertising. Um, I work at WebKite, and we're building tools to help you be a better online advertiser. And I thought it'd be great if we could share some of the fundamental you know, ideas and theories um, so you could find as much success as I have. cost per acquisition uh, or CPA. Um, this is awesome. This is sort of, some, can, some will say the best type of bidding uh, because you're connecting your bid to exactly your ROI. So to do that, you need to, you know, among other things, be able to track conversions. You know, what is a conversion? And that could be, you know, from someone buying a kitchen and mixer or it could be someone signing up for your email list. Um, it's really up to you and it varies from everyone. Everyone's gonna have a different measure of success. Once you know your conversion and you can track that with Google tracking code, um, you'll tell Google AdWords how much, what that means to you. Um, selling a kitchen mixer, it'd be great if a conversion for that was for every $60 you spent, someone bought a kitchen aid mixer because those are expensive and they're great tools. Um, and you would make some money off of that. What Google will do when you're bidding for cost per acquisition is they will change the cost per click on one of your keywords automatically. And so if they see one keyword is converting at a better rate than the other, um, the keyword that's doing better where will have better cost per click and the one that's not doing so well uh, will have a lower cost per click because it's just not as effective. So Google sort of in Google AdWords, the algorithm sort of finds out what's working and puts all your money in the thing that's working, and so you don't spend money on the thing that's not working. Um, and it's awesome because if you, it's all about you know ROI, your return on investment, and if you're able to connect that to your ads and sort of create a funnel where you can perceive the value of your ads and see success, you'll be able to have more intelligent bids and you won't waste money on things that aren't giving you results because at the end of the day, if you're not selling kitchen mixers, uh, what's the point? So, you, you know, it's great if you want people to sign up for an email list, you can set your cost per acquisition at $5 um, and, you know, the bids will be adjusted automatically within those parameters. Um, if you're selling, you know, an object like kitchen mixer, you can set it at $200 and the bids will be adjusted accordingly. Um, it's pretty smart. Um, it takes a little while to set up, it's a little more advanced, but you know, you do reap the benefits of it. It's pretty gnarly. I enjoy it. And so if you have any questions, you can email me uh, dan at webkite.com or you can find us on Twitter at webkite, W-B-K-I-T-E. And we'd love to hear from you and we'll answer your questions in our next uh, video segment. Thank you very much.